Aquatic vegetation is the biggest problem that faces most pond owners. Now an aquatic weed is simply a plant that's out of place or is in too great of abundance that it causes problems. Ponds can benefit from some aquatic vegetation, but in general in the south, aquatic vegetation is not necessary or desirable. However, as you move further north, aquatic vegetation is quite important to adequate reproduction and survival of young bass. Down here in the south, such as Mississippi, this Mississippi pond you see behind me, uh, aquatic vegetation is, is not desirable and we typically recommend it be removed. One way that you can remove vegetation is by stocking a few grass carp when you first stock your pond and they'll keep the vegetation down to a minimum from the beginning. However, once weeds become established, it's important to properly identify that plant and then find the proper control method for it. One way to avoid weed problems in ponds is to build the pond correctly from the beginning. Having the properly sloped shorelines that drop off relatively quickly, we typically recommend a three to one slope to where every three feet you go out into the pond, the depth drops one foot until it reaches three foot in depth to prevent weed growth yet remain safe and stable. By having deeper water, three foot depth and greater, you're shading out most of the pond bottom and not allowing weeds to grow. Excessively shallow areas in the pond, usually areas that are one to two feet in depth, encourage weed growth and can quickly allow a weed to become established and get out of control.